Many indicators and trading strategies require different objects to be drawn on the chart in order to represent the necessary information to the trader in an easy and understandable way. Therefore CTrader allows developers to use API methods to draw different kinds of objects on CTrader charts. In this video, we will develop some sample indicators to demonstrate how you can add lines and icons on CTrader charts. Let's switch to CTrader Algo and create an indicator that will draw the daily pivot points on the chart. Pivot points are price levels calculated from previous prices indicating potential areas of support or resistance. We will start by making this indicator an overlay indicator. We will proceed by defining and getting our daily bars on indicator initialization. Then we will calculate the different support and resistance levels known as pivot points. There are seven values that need to be calculated. The pivot point, three resistance levels and three support levels. Now that we have our pivot points calculated, we will draw them on our chart using trend lines. We will build our indicator and add an instance on the chart. We can see the pivot points being drawn on the chart. We will go back to the ALGO section and create an indicator that will plot the fractals on the chart. We will create a new indicator and name it Fractals Example. Again, we will make this indicator an overlay indicator. In our calculate method, we will draw down arrows above bars where the high value is higher than the two adjacent bars on each side. In a similar manner, we will draw up arrows below bars where the low value is lower than the two adjacent bars on each side. Let's build our indicator and add an instance on the chart. The icons indicating the fractals can be observed above the respective candles. In this video we have demonstrated how to draw lines and icons on the chart. We hope that you found the video helpful. Feel free to ask any questions at the bottom of this video and subscribe to be updated when we publish a new video.